Hi, I'm Linda Ruth from PSCS Consulting. My company helps publishers find their audiences in print and online, develop and optimize those audiences for the greatest profit. And I'd like to thank Schweiky Media for giving me a few moments to spend with you today and talk about topics of most pressing interest to publishers. The main topic of interest to publishers today has to be the monetization of the product, following the money. As print is gravitating, content is gravitating from print to online, and advertising is following it, the dollars are not following at the same rate. The content is moving, the advertising is moving, and the dollars are migrating, but at cents to the dollar. And that is, of course, a huge challenge to publishers everywhere. How to stay in business and keep their heads above water when the dollars are not moving at the same rate that the audience, the content, and the advertisers are moving. And there's a lot of reasons that this may be happening. One of the reasons has to do, of course, with the power of free, which is becoming the norm or the vernacular for online. Another reason, of course, has to do with changing patterns of audience engagement. Why will people spend a dollar to send a gift with no actual value and no actual concrete existence on Facebook, for example, but that same person might not spend a dollar or five dollars or ten dollars to read a news story or a magazine. There's a number of reasons having to do with this, but it can be boiled down to changing patterns of audience engagement. Audience today is looking for more than just straight content. They're looking for content with which they can engage, content with which they can interact, and content with a social element. Content they can share and talk about with their friends, and uh, content that challenges them in a variety of ways. This has to do with the convergence of media online, a topic that I find really fascinating. I call it convergent media. And think about it, in the old days, media was siloed. You had the print, you had the TV, you had the radio. You had something called mixed media, but it wasn't that mixed. It was actually fairly siloed as well, but just stitched together in different kinds of presentations. Today, media is converging in a in a very dynamic way. You have, uh, of course, the video, the digital, the apps, and the audio. You also have mobile, you still have print, and you've got games and gamification. And they all exist for every publisher. Every publisher has to include these various aspects of convergent media in the brand that they take to the world. And this has many implications, and I'm going to just spend a few moments talking about that. Publishers nowadays often say, my, my audience doesn't just read anymore. They consume their media, and they need, we need to be there where they're going to consume it. And that's good as far as it goes. I mean, it's progress. But consumption, to me, still spells passivity. It's much more passive to consume media. Consumption tends to be vicarious, and it tends to be more associated, in my mind anyway, with old siloed forms of media. Nowadays, media needs to be active. It needs to be experiential. It needs to be available everywhere in a branding sense. In other words, it needs to be web-wide. It doesn't just live on crusty old websites at specific URL addresses. It lives, and, and it doesn't only live in, in the apps or the, um, 
the digital versions. It lives everywhere online, not only on your own Facebook page and not only even in your content sharing, but in chat rooms, in forums, in blog posts. And so it becomes very important to craft your brand in an interactive experiential way which is available everywhere. Part of that also has to do with games and gamification. And I'll talk about that a little bit in a future video. For today, I'd just like to leave you with the resources. Um, my site is www.pscsconsulting.com. You can come and uh, join some of the trade associations that I've helped found, Exceptional Women in Publishing, Women in Digital Media, and I do have a um, social media site called Magazine Dojo. Also, let's follow each other and learn from each other. If you follow my company page, PSCS Consulting, I'll make sure that, let me know that you've liked it, and I'll make sure that when you have good bits of news, I'll, we'll feature it on the company page because that's what it's there for. Um, we have a company page on Facebook as well. We can follow each other on Twitter or on Google+. So I'll see you in future videos and thanks so much.